What's up? It is the Grass Goddess and the Solid Fog. I love that new new thing. There, I know. He uses it all the time. <laughs> I went back because I, I was just glancing over the comments and I didn't know who did that. And I should have known it was Dirty. <laughs> dirty, that's an awesome nickname. She's got that one for life now. She is the Grass Goddess. <laughs> AKA, I'm going to have to have a sweatshirt made like the boys. AKA the lawn nurse. It'll be in pink. Though. AKA <laughs> boss lady. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Uh, I can't get it straight because the mountain is a little crooked because Laura uses this for... We're high dollar flying in the forerunner yeah. today. Um, we've got... We're doing a we're doing a rural route. Laura and I are. This is we love this route. This is why we take it because there's horses and cows and pheasant and deer and you one name day it. I'm gonna see a bear. Coyotes. There's everything out here, and so we really like running this route. And uh, so we took this off the production schedule because the production schedule, uh, the production crew has two first time cleanups today. Yep. And they're pretty tall. <laughs> pretty tall uh, so we took a little bit off their schedule so we can help out I guess right. and we had time because we actually don't have any major commercial contracts to mow today right so we're doing this and then we're done yeah yeah this is probably I don't know what three and a half four hours maybe this route maybe. this this portion of the route I don't know we don't pay attention to that one it's just you yeah. and me we're not I, I will say this guys I will say this it's great having Laura and I back in the truck together again because we have so much fun. We do love each other. I mean, we are husband and wife. But um, we're not at production speed as in like what, uh, you know, not knowing you have to do 30 in a day. You can kind of slow it down a little bit. Take your time. Make sure everything's absolutely perfect. And... Um, and enjoy it a little bit. We're not so rush, rush, rush. We can just enjoy it. And we're going to rotate whatever houses we do so that we're able to keep an eye on what our crew did the week before and yep. the week before so that we get an idea and our uh, clients get to see that we're still working and we care about how things are going. Yeah, so keep it that, out good. Keep that communication open. Okay, yeah. yeah. And our crew's good. been fantastic. Yeah. Let's be real. We, we, we won the lotto. Yep, we just got to get their production speed up a little bit, but that will come. That will come. They're yep. just—they're getting there. They're they getting, quality's been really, really good. Really good, and they're making progress. Yeah. yeah. So, guys, I don't know what I'm going to film today. Uh, Maybe some cows, and yeah, some coyotes, yeah, yeah. and some deer. <laughs> We're out in farm country, and it's a—it's a valley out here. It's absolutely beautiful. beautiful. I love this. I love this route. That's why Laura said we're taking this one. I want to see the horses. Yeah. So I will find something for you guys to watch, but we do have, uh, we have several big properties on this road. The, the last one's an acre and a quarter. So we got to make sure Laura doesn't, her knees don't give out on her or something. Got to make sure I don't break. Right, right. We ordered some more uh, pieces, parts for the mowers. I got a bunch of extra blades and we ordered a new Echo PAS system, which is going to be our blade edger. And I also have the uh, weed eater attachment. Uh, as well, so it's going to be our backup trimmer on this trailer and our blade engine, right? Well, I've been thinking about that. Oh boy, here we go. Well, let me get to work, <laughs> listen to what Laura has to say, and um, I don't know. Well, might have to edit the video later. <laughs> we'll be back. So, part of mowing farmhouses is we get requests to mow grass areas, pasture areas, and this is a pasture, it's irrigated. Um, normally, Normally, they don't have cows on it. Um, they don't put cows on this because it's not fenced. So we mow it as needed every two or three weeks. And right now it's about, I don't know, 10, 12, 14 inches tall, depending on where you're at. Well, normally there's not cows on it, right? Uh-oh, somebody snuck out right there. Can you open the gate? I'm not going to go even fight with a cow, but get that. I don't know that cow. That cow can figure it out or he can go someplace else. Now, nah, I'll go open the gate. Let's see if we can do this without getting hurt, honey. Okay, cow. You be nice. Where are you going? He's going into the backyard. Come here, cow. Oh, 
Why don't you just stay there? Well, I was going to open the gate. All right. Go open the gate. And then I'll push them that way. Don't, don't get run over. Can you open that gate? No. Open the gate, honey. Okay, now stand behind that bush over there. So if he comes that way, he can go out the gate. Go on. Come on. Okay, now push him to the gate, sweetie. No, you gotta push. Honey, you gotta push him to the gate. <laughs> Okay, walk towards, yeah, get over there and push him this way. There you go. Right through the gate now. Right through the gate. Come on, a little bit more. Right there. Hi -ya! Little bit more. You're there. No, no, no. <laughs> That's a... We were so close. Just leave the gate open. We'll see if he figures it out. Huh? No, nah, they won't come in. They're going to stay over there. Oh, okay. What? You are not a... What's this hi ya? That's my cowboy voice. <laughs> hi ya. <laughs> well, we'll just mow around the cow here. Let's see what happens. We're going to leave the gate open for a bit and see if he... He, she, I don't even know. She goes back out. Well, I'll go. Play on. <laughs> Success! We're cattle wranglers. What? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. No, it's cow. <laughs> there ain't no chicken. Maybe chicken fried steak. Aw, poor baby. Yeah, so we got that done, guys. We got to mow this. This is uh, about an acre and a quarter, I think this one is, with the field. It's a jack. Yeah. So anyways, we're going to get this out done and uh, I guess we'll call this end of the video. So let me turn around here, Laura, so we can get the cows in the backdrop. All right. Bye, cows.